to help you love life, to always hold you with tenderness, and to have the patience that love demands, to speak when words are needed, and to share the silence when they're not, to agree to disagree on red velvet cake, <laughs> and to live within the warmth of your heart and always call it home. Well, you um, set the bar kind of high. <laughs> Did you write your vows on a menu? Yeah. Why? <laughs> I vow to fiercely love you in all your forms, now and forever. I promise to never forget that this is a once in a lifetime love. And always know in the deepest part of my soul that no matter what challenges might carry us apart, that we'll always find a way back to each other. Do you take each other as spouses forever? I do. <laughs> I, I do. <laughs> and by the power vested in me by the state of Illinois, Security. <clears throat> I now pronounce you man and wife and best friend for one kiss. <laughs> what? Your hair. It looks so different. You look beautiful. Thank you. Okay, look, so I, I've been thinking about something. Okay. What's your favorite book? Uh, it's probably not what you remember. That's fine. That's, that's not the point. Okay. The Beach House by James Patterson. No, really? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> the Beach House. Okay, if it was great, you probably loaned it to somebody, right? Uh, yeah. Gwen, I think. Okay, and you probably said to yourself, God, I wish I was the person that hadn't read it so that I could experience it all over again. Yeah, I guess so. Well, that's how I think we should look at this. Uh, what? You can't remember how we met. Mm -hmm. And you can't remember how we fell in love. And in a way, yeah, that, that sucks. But it was the greatest time in my life. And I just thought how cool it would be to get to experience it all over again. Like reading your favorite book for the first time. Exactly. Which is why I want to ask you out on a date. Uh, <laughs> a date? Like two people that are just meeting for the first time. Well, I don't know. I mean, you know, we've got the wedding coming up. But if we go out before then, you might still be able to take me as your date. I, ca I can't promise anything, but I'll, I'll put in a good word for you. <laughs> All right. Yeah? A date. <laughs> the hell were you thinking? I don't know, that's a really good question because I've been driving myself insane, making a complete ass of myself. Try, literally trying everything possible to try to save what we have. And you've been throwing yourself at Jeremy. That's not fair. It's not fair. I see the way you look at him. I know because you used to look at me that way. Leo. No, uh, I think we just need to start being realistic. Your memory's not coming back. The fact is that I'm still just a stranger. I'm not trying to hurt you. I'm just. <sighs> I'm so tired of disappointing you. I know. I apologize to Gwen and Ryan. Oh, God, no, it's fine. <laughs> Wedding disasters have a way of turning into great stories. Eventually. <laughs> How do you look at the girl you love and tell yourself it's time to walk away?
Leo. I hope one day I can love the way that you love me. You figured it out once. You'll do it again. Hi. Hi. I hope you didn't come all the way into the city for hot chocolate. Actually, I moved back here six months ago. I'm over in Rogers Park. Really? That... That's great. I'm actually back at the Art Institute. What? Are you kidding me? Mm -mm. That's amazing. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm sitting in on a few classes, and I mean, it's, it's crazy what my, my hands remember that my, you know, that my mind forgot. Yeah. So thank you. I didn't do anything. You did everything. You accepted me for who I am, and not for what you wanted me to be. <laughs> I just wanted you to be happy. That's all. Um, isn't there some Cuban place around here where we used to go when this place was closed? Uh, yeah, it's, wait, you remember? No, no. <sighs> I wish. <laughs> no, the memory stuff it's, hasn't come back, but I, Sonia and I have been hanging out a little bit and um, I've been asking her about us. Really? And, and what has she been saying? That she doesn't think you're seeing anyone right now. She just happens to be right. You? Are you, uh, seeing anyone? It's good. So, do you want to go to the Cuban place with me? Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>